And still matters on ICC. We want to cross over to our Masi Kandir in Eldoret. And uh, there's a new twist to this uh, whole witness saga. Masi, uh, bring us up to speed with what this particular man has to say about uh, Deputy President William Ruto's case. Yes, indeed, Betty. Controversy, again, uh, a new twist happening here in the North Rift. Just today, we're just from a press briefing from uh, one of the residents from Nandi County, uh, one, uh, one man who says he's a farmer from uh, Nandi County called Eliud Koech. I'm here with a press statement. He is, a.k.a. he says, Elias Masengo. He says he was a prominent PNU uh, campaigner during the 2007 general election. And what he is alleging today, Betty, is that uh, on the 31st of October 2015, the governor of Nandi County apparently allegedly approached him and told him that they should have a meeting. They met at a certain restaurant here in Alert, and what he is alleging is that the governor of Nandi County had told him to frame Senator Arab Sang uh, and tell and uh, say that he had participated in the coaching of witnesses against the ICC cases. And what he's saying that he's coming out now to say that he refused that deal, what he says was promised a job at the county and money. Uh, but yes, the Betty, that's the new controversy right now here. Remember, it comes barely a week after two other residents from Nandi County claiming uh, their witnesses and they were alleging that Senator Rapsang had participated. Uh, this the farmer from Nandi County, Mr. Koech, says that in that particular meeting he was seated with uh, Senator Charles Keter, who also said that he excused himself from that meeting and that he will not participate in the politics of that county. Uh, See, Betty? Masi, these are damning allegations. Uh, does he have any sort of ev evidence uh, in regard to what he is claiming? Uh, Betty, what he has is actually no particular evidence. What he says that one of his people who was there that he witnessed the meeting between him and Governor, uh, Governor Cleophus Lagat of Nandi is uh, Senator Charles Keter, who he says stepped aside. But also, he also gave us a statement signed by himself claiming the allegations that he's now uh, having against uh, Governor of Nandi County. But also, Betty, remember, uh, right of reply, we are in contact with the Nandi County Governor who is able to give us his uh, right of reply uh, as the day pans out. Betty. Finally, you spoke of uh, political intrigues in Wasimgishu County that are sort of like, uh, uh, you know, in getting involved in uh, the deputy president's case. Maybe you can just expound a little bit on that. Oh, yes. Point of correction, Betty, Nandi County and not Wasingishu. So there's a lot of politics. There has been a lot of uh, not smooth relationships in some counties between uh, the senators and the governors. So in Nandi County, there has been a lot of controversy in terms of relationships between the governor and the senators. So yes, a lot of questions to be raised in the terms of the authenticity city of this, considering that there has been a lot of uh, controversies surrounding that particular relationship between the governor and the senator, Betty. Thank you very much, Masi Kandia, the reporting from Wasingishu County, of course, giving us the details of the latest intrigues in the William Ruto case. Apparently, a man known as uh, Elliot has just come up saying that he uh, apparently or allegedly was uh, coerced to... Uh, be to be a witness uh, by the Nandi governor, but of course we will be getting uh, uh, clear details on this particular developing story, uh, and Maskandia will be bringing us those developments in our bulletins throughout the day.